welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are about to unbox my Jimmy Choo's. They are the Bing Flats. They're super pretty. We're heading to Napa Valley in three weeks from now and I wanted to get some nice flats that I can wear around the vineyard since it's not the best place to wear heels. And so I found two pairs of flats. We're gonna, this is going to be a comparison video. So one is Jimmy Choo and one is going to be a comparable dupe from Calvin Klein that I found at Nordstrom Rack. So stay tuned for the unboxing and for the comparison. If you're new here, my name is Jody. I review lots of luxury products so you can scroll through the playlist for other videos that interest you. I also document my sister lot journey and have playlists on that as well. Without further ado, let's get started with today's video. All right guys, so this is the Jimmy Choo. And this is a Calvin Klein from Nordstrom Rack. So the Calvin Klein pair was $50. They are cute, they are kind of chic. I'll let you decide. So these are a size eight. For me, they're true to size, they're 50 bucks. Comparable value is 90. So when they were probably being sold at Calvin Klein retail, they retailed for $90 but found them on sale for 50 bucks at Nordstrom Rack. So that's what they look like. Let's take a look at our Jimmy Choo. Already, difference, beautiful packaging, right? I went to the Jimmy Choo store here in Atlanta. It is in the shops at Buckhead where a lot of other luxury stores are, including Christian Louboutin. Here goes our Jimmy Choo box. I really love the colors that they use. So chic. All right, let's pop this open. By the way, if you like my dress, I have put a link in the description box. It is from Le Glace, which is a local boutique here in Atlanta. It is a small business that is run by a woman. She's super sweet. So here we go. We get two dust bags with this. Open this up. Ta-da! So these are the Jimmy Choo Bing Flats. They also come in a mule. You've probably seen the mule. They're like a higher heel and they're super chic, super classic, very pretty. But this is a flat version for my trip to Napa and I think they're super pretty. Comparison wise, I know that the style looks a lot like this Calvin Klein. So like, why is this one $7.95? Why is this $1.50? Well guys, that's just how the luxury world works. This is real patent leather from the finest of materials made in Italy. Um, these crystals are super beautiful, high quality. We're about to see how they look. Also just service and packaging and all of that. Like I went to the Jimmy Choo store, I was greeted by the sales associate, George, who was so sweet. He even gave me recommendations for what to do in San Francisco and Napa Valley, gave me his personal cell phone number. He's from there and he went the extra mile to help me curate a great experience. Um, was sitting there waiting on him to get my stuff packaged, brought out Fiji water and beautiful napkins and just made the thing, made the whole experience just so comfortable and so wonderful. Now, is that worth the difference in price? Um, it's a part of it. You know, if you're going to buy luxury, that's what comes with it. And also just the fact that you'll probably have the product forever. I anticipate having these in my collection for many, many years to come, while something like this will probably die at some point soon. So it's kind of an investment, right? But either way, style does not need to be expensive. So I highly, highly recommend always finding beautiful things that are within the budget.
I'm sure you'll agree with me that these shoes are just so beautiful. They are to die for. Um, I don't think I showed you the detail earlier, so this is how it looks. Just really beautiful, high quality sparkles going all the way around and the nicest patent leather. They are very, very comfortable to wear. They remind me of Dorothy from, um, what's that show? Dorothy, Alice in Wonderland. Was it Alice in Wonderland? Or is there another show with a Dorothy? I'm thinking of a Dorothy who had some slippers. <laughs> Help me clarify that childhood memory, but I feel like this is what her shoes would have looked like. Just so beautiful, sparkly, really pretty. So guys, I am headed to Napa Valley as I was telling you. So look out for that vlog. I'm going to vlog the entire seven days that we are there. We're going on a hot air balloon, going to many vineyards, wine tastings, things like that. So you don't want to miss it. Look out for that vlog in a few weeks. And I'm going to film a get to know me. So please put your questions in the comment section. Anything that you want answered, whatever you're curious about, please let me know in the comments. See you friends in another video.